All right, my stackers. This is Stack of Facta coming back at you. It's actually still Monday. I know this video is dropping on a Tuesday, but I can't really drop two videos on the same day or YouTube starts playing games with the algorithm and buries my videos. Not that I really care. I mean, I say a lot of stuff that's not exactly politically correct. So YouTube hates me anyway. And I don't take any sponsorships because I don't want to make you guys sit through stupid video advertisements like a lot of other stackers do. It's just shameless. It's, it's kind of sad, really. It's pathetic. I just like showing you guys straight silver. I don't even do intros to these videos anymore. And let me show you guys what I got. I really don't even know what's in this one. This was packaged very... DIY, but at the same time, it's effective. Um, I know you guys can't feel this package, but uh, this feels really secure. So, another new seller, at least new to selling to me. And it's a pleasure to have someone pack well. I've had some pieces of silver just show up rattling around in a box, and uh, it's just not fun. Man, look at how this guy did this. He made little pockets. Now, I save a lot of my Amazon boxes and other type of boxes. So when I sell, I don't have to do this. But let's see. I think that's all of them. I don't want to miss anything. Oh, no, there's one in here. Jesus. This guy's got this in a little pocket here on the side. Still, no complaints. Thank you, seller, whoever you are. I got to check and see exactly who I got these from. Uh, okay, here we go. I think this might have been someone I bought from before. I could kind of tell by the way he packaged it in these little baggies. Uh, this is uh, a decent haul here, seven ounces. Let's see what we got. Oh, man. This <laughs> is so funny. Uh, okay, these are not air tights, but that's okay. I'm going to slap them in some air tights in just a second here. All right, let's get them out and let's get them on screen. Now, I can already tell these are very, very nice condition. These are absolutely BU. Here's a Lunar Rabbit. I don't have any of these. I've never owned one of these before. Gorgeous coin. Oh, I can't wait to get this into a capsule. Nice and safe. Here is another koala. I got a bunch of these. Oops. Got a bunch of these, but um, I don't think I have any in this good of condition. I bought from this seller actually pretty recently in one of my uh, last two or three videos, actually. You can see um, some of the stuff he sent me. I thought this was a new seller just because the way he packaged the outside, but it's not a new seller. It is definitely someone I bought from, and yeah, I'll give him a shout out in the description. A nice 20, what is it, 2024? Where's the date? Yep, 2024 American Silver Eagle. And what else? We got a couple more of them in here. Let's get these out and inspected. And this one is even nicer than the last one. Absolutely gorgeous. And you can tell it's an eagle by this sound. Right off the bat, you can tell that is a real American Silver Eagle. Now I'm going to put these on the Sigma, of course. If I have time, that is. But uh, I've dealt with so many American Eagles that I know exactly what the real ones look, sound, and feel like. Let's see, what else we got in here? We got something else. I see a king, quote unquote. Um, oh yeah, another turtle. And this one feels thick. Is this another two ouncer? Did I get two two ounce turtles today? Yeah, yes. Gorgeous, yes, I love these little turtles. It's so weird that I've just been getting so many of them lately. Now, the uh, last two turtles that I got, the one ounce ones, were from this same seller, so that's not surprising. But the other one I showed you guys in the capsule um, yesterday, that one uh, came from a new seller. So, 
there's so many guys when you buy and sell online that you just kind of like lose track and yeah it's really fun you meet some crazy people this is my first owl um let's see what is this it's a saint helena saint helena owl look at that background this is east india company i can already tell east india company is the one who minted this um, you can tell by that background although i will have to double check i will have to double check but i know they do a lot of saint helena stuff anyway that uh rim here is super unique i've never seen that before Look at the peepers on this guy. I wish I had some really small googly eyes. I would put them on there. Actually, I do have some really small googly eyes. <laughs> I might have to uh I might have to put those on. Let me see. Hold on a second, guys. All right. So, not only do I stack silver, but I stack the googly eyes. So, let me try to find some really small ones. Oh, the green ones. The green ones are pretty cool. Or the yellow. I I always have yellow eyes, right? God, I hope this doesn't leave some, like, nasty resin on this coin that just tones it. <laughs> okay, I think that's another yellow one. Yes, it is. Okay. Now, getting the little adhesive off the back of these with gloves on is going to be really difficult. I might have to uh, use my knife here. Let's get this koala and this rabbit and this turtle out of the way. I don't want to scratch them or anything. See if I can get that adhesive off. Almost got it. There we go, okay. Got one peeper on. <laughs> All right, let's get the second one on. Uh, guys, I'm just totally winging it for this video, so if you think I'm an idiot, um, yeah, I, I am, so. But I'm rolling with it, I'm rolling with <laughs> it. Well, you know, it's realistic at least. Alice got these big ass eyes, but yeah, you know. A little humor for Monday, right? A little humor for Monday, but uh, another nice haul. Seven ounces of really, really cool shiny. Um, of course, I still prefer to stack eagles when I can, guys. I know stuff like this is really cool and probably has a much higher premium than the good old American birds. But this is American currency, and um, the other ones aren't. I'm American, I take pride in my country, and uh, I like these coins over all other coins. And the premiums on them aren't bad right now, um, at least when you're buying online. A lot of stuff like um, this, has super high premiums um not so much the rabbits the rabbits are are pretty common but there are other lunar calendar coins that are just going for a fortune i know pandas are really hot right now i know libertads are just off the heezy right now libertads are going for like 36 37 bucks i don't know why you would buy them when you can buy american eagles for like 33 right now like two dollars over spot for an american eagle I'll take that all day long. Um, a lot of people don't like the Series 2 with this eagle, but I've actually grown to like it. I know the clipped wing design, the clipped wing design is kind of um, not anyone's, not everyone's favorite because it's like they're clipping the wings of freedom or whatever. But you know, it it just still it still looks cool. I can't really get the. I don't think I have a small enough eye for my American Eagles, but that's okay. They don't need to be desecrated like the, <laughs> like the owl. But oh man, I can get really far up in there. Yep, absolutely beautiful coin. Um, let me show you guys this turtle one more time just to see, just to show you how thick this bad boy is. Awesome, awesome. Now these aren't perfect, the turtle, the American Eagle, even the owl has a little bit of like a scratch there and some milkage, but really don't care. I got a million capsules, just like you guys heard in my last video. And in fact, let's get some out right now and see what we can get going in a capsule. Now, because it's still Monday, um, 
I don't really have too many spot updates for you. Oh, I got that one just right. You can tell what size it is by the rim, which is the naked eye. Or sometimes you could put a coin in there and shake it and uh, get a pretty good idea. But that is a beautiful fit. Ooh, love it. No space in there to be rattling around. Nice, another koala for the stack. Let's see what else we got. This is a Morgan capsule. No, that's not gonna fit in there. I need to find, I forget what the, the millimeters are. That's how you measure these capsules. Um, this looks too big. That's an American Eagle capsule. The Eagles fit in these ones just absolutely perfectly, but I don't, I don't capsule my Eagles. Um, let's see, do I have one here? I might have to keep reaching in to this giant endless pit of capsules that I have. Yeah, these are all Eagle capsules. Eagle, Eagle, Eagle. Let's see. I don't know what kind of capsule this is here. This looks like a, oh, it's a Morgan capsule. Morgan capsule, another Eagle. Oh, this one might work, let's see. Yep, there we go. Okay, that's a perfect fit. Let's get that up in there. These Australian coins just are so impressive. They do everything right over there. Except for their kangaroos that are just milky AF, but I mean, koalas, the Lunar Series, just gorgeous stuff. Let's see if I can find one for this St. Helena coin. This is kind of an odd sized coin. Oh, there we go. That fits in there nicely. Real nice. Okay. Hopefully, hopefully those beepers don't turn, uh, don't tone from the. Uh, adhesive but you know what if they do they do i'll probably just make the coin cooler <laughs> oh god i'm a dork i'm a dork guys but another nice fit and it doesn't look like it would fit in there because it's all like that weird shape but the the rim is actually round it's just the inside of the rim that's cut funny like that and as far as this two ounce turtle i have no clue i'm gonna have to see if i have a uh Queen's Beast or Creatures of the North capsule that it'll fit in. I forget which one's which. I know um, the two ounce Queen's Beasts and the two ounce Creatures of the North are slightly different in size and you need a bigger two ounce capsule for one and a smaller for the other. Um, so I got to double check because I think this is the wider size and I only have the smaller two ounce capsule. So I might just have to keep this one raw. This would actually be a pretty cool um, desk piece. Use it as a little paperweight or just keep it on the desk to play with. It's not in the best condition. Um, although it's not in bad condition at all. It's just got a little scrape and you know, a little milk and stuff. But this seller has been really coming through and I really appreciate them. So another nice haul guys. And uh, yeah, keep uh, keep a lookout. I got um, another unboxing coming your way in a few days. I got like, what is it, 14 new coins coming, um, all Canadian wildlife. They're really milky, and uh, I'm going to show them off, and then I'm going to clean them up for you. So this is Stacker Factor signing off. As always, guys, keep on stacking.